Yeah, so, um, while everyone and their mothers were playing Black Ops 3 now, because of double crypto keys, I get a new pop filter for my blue snowball, and I'm playing Until Dawn. It's been a while since I last played this game, I know, but it's gonna be like once every week, I think. Until one week I can't do it because of my PS4 and HDCP and all that. Which I've disabled, but I can't go on YouTube with my PS4 anymore, which it's alright, I just go on my Xbox One instead. So, um, yeah, so resuming where we left off, which was, um, it was where we just met Sam. Here we are, here's Sam, Sammy Sue. So now we're gonna, like, um, we're gonna see he heads this cabin, if I remember. So when we last left off, it was, um, like there was a machete guy behind us at the bus. And now there is a, there's a gate. Huh. Is it right to say so? Look around. Objects that lint can be expect inspected. Sick. The gate's busted. Oh, I'm over. Nice one. Alright. Let's fucking go up here then. Quick or safe? Quick. Why not? Fucking. I forgot to turn that off on my controller. No, no, you guys are gonna have to deal with it. Uh, climb. Doesn't take 20 years to climb up a brick wall. I mean, I wouldn't know that, but, you know, it's just... She just took so long. I mean, I'm pretty sure she's not a fucking turtle. Okay, so... Those are the lights I'm assuming up to the cabin. What's squirrel? When the don't move icon is on the screen, do the... Oh. Shit! Oh uh, well, fuck. Okay. Okay. Alright, what the fuck do I have to do? Oh, thank god. Wasn't sure what I had to do there. It's a bit weird. That's quite weird. I'm sure about your next objective. Oh, here's the cable car station. Okay. Why not? Hope the game isn't just like, just running around a bit like this. It's, it'd be, what's this? Diggers people the butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believe that butterflies carried dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The colour of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Death. Black butterflies pr prophesied the dream as death. Dangerous events. Tragedy affecting friends. Visions to help and guide. Luck and good fortune. Okay. Sure. Uh, wait, is that brown? Or That's the brown one, isn't it? It reveal a colour butterfly and the pre monetization of possible futures. And we just pick it up like all the others. A birdie! Oh, I don't know who the hell that was hiding behind the thing, but alright. Future is uncertain. Whether you whether the prophecy comes true or not depends on the choices you make. Alright. I wanted to view the totems. Chris, you here? Chris, eh? That's Chris's bag. Not in the bag, are you? <laughs> Not in the bag. Sick. Hello. Ooh, a phone. What, has he been texting a girl or something? Snoop. <laughs> I'm a bad person. Oh shit, does that mean I did something wrong? Oh no, that just means a butterfly effect. Ashley! Oh! He knows it. Fucking hell. Alright then, Chris. Chris has a crush on Ashley. Yeah, p nice pointing that out there, game. <laughs> Made it a bit obvious. Literally, it's just like, 
even in like no description of who he is. It's like sorry, it's like not like Chris, the smart guy. It's Chris has a crush on Ashley. Fucking brilliant. That's just brilliant. Oh, what'd you find? Amazing. What? I'm not gonna see for you. yourself. Oh, okay. This way. I'm gonna get fondled. Where? Right around here. It's gonna blow your mind. Yep, definitely getting fondled. He said, "Blow your mind." All right, fucking. And you know what? Let, uh, I think we should exit now. All right, fucking. What do we? What's here? Clue found. Wanted poster. Oh, look at this. Mm, Victor Milgram. Height 62, that's an address, Blackwood Pines. 1998, that's not really a clue, is it? It's 2015, this game set, I think. Or present day, I should say. Ta da! What, what is it? What is yeah? Look at those beauties. What? What the fuck are you on about? Wait. Was that a gun? It's a shooting range, but... Alright, oh, that's a gun, yeah. Well... I think he's Grizzly Adams or something. Okay, then. You ain't Grizz? Chris, you ain't Grizz? Oh, fuck. Right, we gotta, gotta get my control freaks on. Here we go. Uh... Aim... R2. Okay. Pretty simple. Mate, I am optic nade shot. I missed. There we go. I actually just shot right beneath it. Wow, nice <laughs> All right. Oh my god. I'm assuming too. Chris, so. you ain't Grizz. I'm gonna shoot here. God damn. Well. Squirrel. Oh, I can't shoot the squirrel. No, I can't do that. Wait, am I allowed to be a mean person? <laughs> I'm allowed to be a mean person. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that though. I'll just shoot that. Nice shot. Thank you. Your ass <laughs> got sacked. Oh well, fucking all right then. Fuck it, all right then, love. Fucking that, that's our wrap and go. Come on, Chris. No, you want to be Grizz and all, but come on. No, oh, that'd be useful late in the game. Fucking hell. Where are we meant to be going anyway? It sure is. Fucking. Why would you come back here after a year when not like a month or something? And everyone's settled down, but okay then. People. I was gonna say homeless, but all right then. I was gonna say why would a homeless person be up here? <laughs> Chris, you are the gentleman without a suit. So we're going cable car. But we have to get it down, don't we? Alright, let's go now. Also, sorry about the mic quality again. Because like, I'm still trying to test out this mic. And it might turn out alright, I never know. Blackwood Pines, Hotel and Sanatorium for a healthy body and mind. Okay. Sure, why not? Uh, cable car? No, that... Why is there just a cam... I was going to say, why was there a camera on the hot tub? That's, that was weird. Wait. Is that just a hint? To what's going to be in the future? Oh, well, foreshadowing. Where am I meant to be going? Where the f am I meant to activate it here? I'm not understanding. What am I meant to be doing? Ah, <laughs> Jesus Christ! Fucking hell! 
Oh, we have to wait. All right. Okay. Okay. Nah, I'm all right. You go ahead, love. I don't want to get fucking trapped up there. I'm gonna get raped by a guy called Charlie in the middle of the fucking woods. <sighs> well, it's gonna take a while. I guess it's because his friends are coming back and it'll like help him out. Ignore that voice crack. But like, yeah, it's just like, it'd be a while. They were like his friends and shit. Like, I mean, I wouldn't really fucking. If, okay, man. But I wouldn't really trust the same people that caused the sister's death. Like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't trust them again. You know how Josh and I met? It was a fucking prank gone wrong? Third Jesus grade. Christ! I'm surprised that's not Josh on YouTube. Get a million views right there. Fucking hell. Roaming out wood, Fuzzy Tube. They're all doing it. Oh, well, that's how you get famous nowadays. God. Now you just need gone wrong in the hood. Like fucking tie you on, then you're good. Sisters died. Prank gone wrong in the hood. Even though you're in the woods, so it don't make any sense. But who cares? People are gonna click on it. Uh, I'm already taking the piss. Wait, am I meant to? Probably meant to be listening to this because it was like a fucking a girl hitting puberty and fucking training bra and then, but butterfly effects. What is happening? I'm just talking about shit. That's a fucking loud car. Jesus Christ, sounds like a hurricane. Oh, who the hell's this? Jess. Mike's new girlfriend. Oh. Was that the guy who was, um... With that... So that new girlfriend. Was the old one? Like, the black-haired girl. Was that what he... Was that who he was... Originally dating. <laughs> what the hell? Fucking hell. Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? <laughs> We're stuck Sick. in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. please. All right. I would just shut the door and leave him to it, but you know, you're a nice person. Jesus Christ, Chris. <laughs> well, it ain't wrong there. Okay, then. <laughs> well, our choices did matter. Ooh, Michael Monroe. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our just be capable of imagining? <laughs> Chris. Um, expect uh right, insist. Fucking we're not explaining to this piece of shit. This blonde that prick. Tool. tool and die. Tool and die, that's what <laughs> Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosy around in other people's not Okay then. Uh yeah, I I try not to do that. <laughs> Come on, Jess, you can tell us. It totally keeps you there. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. Sick. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the lodge already. I'm getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait for you. Who are you for? <coughs> Mike. But, um... <laughs> well, yeah, what? Chris, fucking brilliant. I you explained it well yourself. Whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see the view? I mean, holy cow. Really? You said holy cow. Right, where's the fucking bleach? Um... Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Oh my god. Is she the. She's intelligent, resourceful, and persuasive. Shit, I didn't see Jess. Or Chris. Oh, that's fucking pitiful. She's intelligent and in that. And that's Matt. Motivated, ambitious, and active. Okay, so he's kind of like the jock. Oh, fuck. Am I gonna have to be this girl's fucking slave? Really? Don't be no fucking bellboy. 
Okay out. then. Oh. Yeah. She's intelligent enough. She would like be able to carry her own things and shit. Not like but okay then. I mean... Fucking hell! Ah! Oh Jesus. Jesus, Mike, you piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck you, Mike, you piece of shit. He's intelligent, driven, and persuasive. Uh, okay then. Fucking, you're cl clearly yeah. fucking very Michael. intelligent. See my face, fucking, if I face cam, fucking you screenshot and put it all over fucking Twitter if I recall. No need for violence, I'm going to fucking shank you. Spirit of things. Sorry. It's not fucking, it's snowing, in the middle of the woods, it's night, and it's fucking creepy. Why the fuck? Alright, Fresson, back off, Mike. Welcome. You know what? I kind of like Mike, even though he's kind of an asshole for scaring me. I, I like him. You know what? Fucking, we're all friends here. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, super super awkward. awkward. Well, and we all know it. Let's just. I don't really uh, say that. Now, but okay. Okay. Nah. I hear you, man. <laughs> I get it. I don't want to make this weird. What did fucking did Emily want to want me to go fucking wolf mode? <laughs> Wanted me to go alpha. Oh my god, totally. We're totally gonna make a. Fuck, fuck you, Mike. Oh, now, oh, no, nah, I'm gonna fucking <laughs> just gonna replay that. I'm gonna fucking be a massive cunt. Massive cunt, and Mike anyway. Oh crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? Really? Bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, Why? Why? I need to go find Why do you need to go find Sam? Okay. Sorry, I just I really need to go find her. I totally forgot. You know, this I is the point where I think she's cheating. Really can't wait. And she's gonna <laughs> fucking have Important. some fun yeah. with Mike, but she's apparently intelligent. So fucking I I don't know. I'm not sure to let her go or not. She's intelligent, so she might not go and do that. Then again, the character right now, eh, it's kind of both ways. Fucking, let's uh, mm, that's, that's agree. Fucking, why not? Let's not fucking right. piss off the angry fucking dragon over here. Like Jesus like Christ! Of course, the rest of the way, but you owe me one. Excuse me. Well, the more even, at least. I'll think about it. <laughs> Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. You know, if I was Matt. I would just go and fucking do one, throw the bags into the woods somewhere for the fucking machete man to go cut it open. What's so important in those fucking bags apart from clothes? You're gonna need any. You'll be dead by the time it's dawn. Until dawn. Oh, I'm going to go drink bleach. <gasps> Ashley has a crush on Chris. Academic, inquisitive, and Fourth, right? Alright. Sure. They both have a cross on each other. Just get together, man. Fucking, just, just get together. Alright, so, wait, where the fuck's the lodge? Wait, where is it? Fuck is it? Ah, down there. Ah, Jess is waiting for someone down there. See ya. Man, I was ready to go, see. So what the f oh. oh, I knew it! Oh. Fucking, I knew it was doing stuff with fucking Mike. I knew that. I knew it. Fuck, oh, fuck you. Kind of way. Fuck you, fucking piece of shit. God damn. You know what? You're a massive cunt. You know that, Mike. You're actually fucking. Oh. <laughs> Matt, I'm going to stab you. You're such a piece of shit. Man, yeah, it's so fucking sorry, awkward as shit. Okay, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy? Uh, Let me check it out. Fuck it. You know what? Encourage. You know what? He he needs to see what this bitch is doing. Um, and I probably sure, fucked up uh, somewhere. Go ahead. Knock yourself out. Yes. Oh, uh, never mind. They are hugging. I mean, they just had a hug. I mean, it's nothing serious. I thought he was going in for a fucking kiss before. 
But, you know. Matt, don't go overboard. It's just a fucking hug, man. God. You know what? I hope this character, like, fucking dies early. Well, it's, de it's depending on my choices, so. You know, we're not going to see Matt very much, ladies and gentlemen. Jessica is wasting up. Okay, we'll go. Read book. <laughs> Read book in fucking present time. Mate, this is Jess. She is the type of girl. She would pick a phone over a book. She would pick texting her friends over studying. This bitch right here defines every schoolgirl. Nah, I'm just joking. But a uh, fucking uh, uh, typical American schoolgirl, anyway. Oh my god, what Stacy's doing on my phone? Jesus Christ. Oh, you did not just. You did not want. Mike. Oh yeah, that's his new girlfriend. Oh fucking Jesus! The, the accent, the accent. Uh shit! Grab Snowball. Return fire. Fire! Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck you, Mike. Ooh, here we go. You ready? Open fire! Shots fired. Bullseye! Oh! Quick time offense. Ah, I forgot they were in that. Fucking in this game. Piece of shit. Ooh, birdie! That's the bird from the totem! That's the bird from the totem! That's the bird from the totem! No, you fucking don't. Hey, Mike. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> Where's my fucking wraith? Where's my mothership? That is generally the bird. Look, wait, tutorial? Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Yeah, the, that's the one from the bench. Can I not take fire shots of this guy? Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Jesus Christ, the PS4 has a fucking... The controller has a fucking fit when you do absolutely nothing. No. I'm trying not to piss off that much. Hope we don't accidentally kill him. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! Oh fucking hell! Uh, um. So did I go down? I don't think so. Um. So, um, so are we calling it my favor then? <laughs> what the fuck? Miss Jessica, the snowball queen. All right, um, vaguely dirty, my lady. Grab snowball kit. We don't roll that way, Mike. Fuck you, Mike. We don't roll that way. <laughs> what am I gonna get? Oh, God. I can think of at least one. Yep. They're gonna have to bang. Yep, they're gonna bang. Wait till later. That, that's banging. The fucking. Jesus Christ. It's isn't exactly Romeo and Juliet. Fucking. Can this go past already? Fucking. I thought this was a horror movie. Not a fucking romance comedy. Just making out. Well then. Cable car. Status update. Okay. Did we finally arrive, or is that someone else? Oh, we're back with the psychiatrist guy again. Doctor Hill. And how are we? Do you imagine his first name was Silent? Oh God. Surprised we don't see Pyramid Head in this fucking room. You were not complete. I was honest with you. You're a piece of shit. I hate. I don't like this guy. This time, well, don't the you root of our anxiety. anxiety. We don't have any fucking anxiety. She has set pictures of symbols which you identify with which images in each set. All right, let's go. Makes you most anxious. Go. Uh. 
Well, I'm socially inept, so, you know, we'll, we'll just take the right option. I'll have to sweat. That's so fucking cool. Planes scare me, crowds scare me. Crowds aren't fucking big of a deal, even though I'm socially inept. Planes scare me more than anything. Because I don't trust the pilots. I want to do that more. I fear heights or drowning. Heights, I'm able to see my own death. Drowning? Oh, they're both ter terrible. Heights is fine. Because... Uh, like, uh, I don't know how to explain this. It's kind of like, heights are kind of fine. I mean, you you kind of have... You kind of have false hope, in a sense. When you fear heights, and you accidentally fall. Because uh, you always hear stories of people surviving from, like, fucking... A thousand foot drop. And they recover fine. But drowning, like fucking, it's oh, I can just imagine it. So when drowning, they're stuck at the bottom of the ocean. Their eyes are open and shit. Oh, yeah, I'll take drowning. It. I'll, I'll fear drown, drowning anyway, any day. I'll fucking, I'll fall off a cliff before I drown. Snakes or ra Not really either, to be honest. Snakes scare me. Rats scare me. Rats, um, fucking cause illness and shit. Snakes? Uh, depends what kind of snake. Rattlesnakes, I'll just, I don't know, I'll just hit it with a stick. Because I'm an idiot. Rats, I can, you can easily get rid of. Pick it up by the tail, chuck out your fucking house, something like that. Snakes are a lot harder to get rid of, so you know what, let's go with snakes. Voice crack central over here, fucking Jesus Christ. I'm going to turn the page again. Would I rather get guns or knife? Knife, you can see it coming. I really, really, I don't really mind either. I mean, knives are kind of, I don't know, but knives you can like the person, the murderer, well, someone who's trying to stab you, they could like wiggle it around your body. That would feel, kind of feel weird. But guns, you're gonna be scared of if it's pointed at you because fucking, you know, you're either gonna get shot or he's gonna let you off the hook. A knife is just one way. It's just, it's just one way where it's gonna go. You're gonna get stabbed. So I think guns scare me more than knives. Do I have to sweep? Oh, I love this. It's so cool. Oh, we're back here. Cockroaches. Fuck. Who's scared of cockroaches? No one is scared of cockroaches. They are so small. They are so defenseless. I mean, they're fucking hard to kill. But no, they're defenseless. Cockroaches, once again, cause illnesses. I can see why you're scared of that. But, you know, snakes. Why would you pick cockroach? It's just fucking piece of shit. Um, I mean, fucking clowns don't scare me. Scarecrows. I mean, fuck it. I know scarecrows, like, can't be alive and shit. But you always, like, it feels like they're staring at you and shit. God disgusts me. Not really. Cro None of these... Neither of these are fucking... None of them scare me. Crows, what the f... The only way you can get scared of a crow that comes and fucking pecks you. Even though it's got to do much unless it fucking tries to bite your eye out. I don't know. So either would I rather be scared of a black bird that can be aggressive sometimes or gore that's inside of me. I have no fucking clue. Fucking birds, why not? I'd rather see a body than fucking... Fucking crows. Try to... Oh, I have to rely on my instincts, really? Alright, so I'm not allowed to talk anymore. Alright, fucking, you know. Trying to make it interesting. Uh, Alright. What's next? Spider snakes. Spiders are fucking simple. Uh, needles are crows. Needles are fine. Uh, scarecrows more. Zombies are stupid. You can easily outsmart a zombie. All right. You know what? Just the one time, right? Dogs, they can hunt you down. They can fucking chase you. 
You, you, if you piss off a dog, you're fucked. Storms, dogs. I mean, storm, you have like a one in a million chance you're gonna get fucking striked. This is very interesting. And dogs is just guaranteed to kill. Dogs or wolves? They're both equivalently bad. Snakes, scarecrows, and dogs. If you put that, if you put those in this game, I am going to stab you. So we go Friday night. Sick. Yeah, you're really fucking funny. Well done. Do you want a trophy? Oh, yeah, you're a piece of shit. I don't want to see you anyway. We will talk again very soon. Nice. Is that like a bit of an intro to the game as well? Or is it just all in one go? I wouldn't really mind that, to be honest. Previously. Why not until dawn? Yeah, so I think I'll just stop it here. Because, I mean, we just, we just gone past the intro. It's only just begun. And I'm already getting fucking scared. By some of them. Anyway. So this is Until Dawn. It's still fucking fun as shit. And I hope to enjoy it more. I mean, if I see dogs, scarecrows, fucking snakes... Then you know what, I'm done. I'm just done if that shit happens to me.